Aberdeen's Duffy Park has won many awards due to recent restorations over the summer, the latest being from the Aberdeen Civic Society for craftsmanship and the overall project. We're delighted that the hard work everyone's put in towards the restoration has been um, recognised and these awards we've been receiving recently. We've seen a, a huge rise in numbers this year, um, obviously due to the fact that the restoration has been finished and also uh, the good summer weather we've had this year for a change and also the new play park we've opened in the park as well has attracted a lot of um, children to the park. The restoration costing 5.2 million was paid for by funding for both Aberdeen City Council and the National Lottery Fund. This helped to improve the park's safety and accessibility, which has been appreciated by the park's visitors. Duthie Park has always been a treasure in Aberdeen, but we've, we've, uh, it was maybe getting a little tarnished and tired, but the, that is no longer the case. It's fantastic. The, uh, some of the new r ramps make it more accessible to those who've got limited mobility. Uh, the, it's great to see the ponds filled again and uh, just the whole area is just great and anybody who hasn't been there I would encourage them to go and visit. Over 850,000 people visited the park last year with over 300,000 visiting the David Welsh Winter Gardens alone making it one of Europe's most popular indoor gardens. Extensive work has been done all around the park to ensure that Duthie Park remains a family favourite in Aberdeen for decades to come. Simon Kermack, Aberdeen Southside.